I've been an entrepreneur since I was, oh God, 23 years old. I've always been an entrepreneur. I opened my first store uh, when I was 23, always. I've always had that DNA. Um, it's, it's been in my blood from day one. Joining first the big startup, right, so that you understand what a startup is all about. You know, what kind of mess is in, right? Like it's, it's, a, it's a constant mess, it's a constant chaos because you're growing so fast. So the problem that you solve for today are not the ones you're solving for tomorrow, right? You always have to resolve a like, different type of problems. But it's, um, I think that this is where it really came up, right? So I think uh, I don't, it's not like it was, I was like 10 years old and I started my own my first venture. I, it's just, I just think that this is where, this is the most exciting path uh, by far. And it's only after testing a couple of other paths uh, that I came to the realization of it. I always say that entrepreneurs are not made, they're born. Uh, you have to have that DNA and that risk factor where like, you don't care like what anyone says and that you don't fear failure. What matters is where you are when you want to use the service and we're trying to optimize the whole network on, uh, behind it. So we try really to, to make sure that whether you're at the beach or you're in the mall, you can still send and receive anything. But I think that the difficult thing for, for me, I would say, and, and my opinion, was it's really hard to set up a company here. Um, you know, everyone says the United States is hard. I'm from the US, but it's much harder here to set up a company than it is in the United States. I, you know, and I say this all the time, Dubai is definitely the best of the Middle East, no question, but there's so much more that we can do to make it easier for entrepreneurs to come here and thrive. It's hard enough, and I say this all the time, for companies like IBM to come here with localization to succeed, and they have billions of dollars. How hard is it for a startup who has no money to be under the same regulations and, and laws and, 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 and uh, visa requirements and, and all the, the registration as, as an IBM? So, you know, I think we're heading in that direction, but there's still so much more that needs to be done to help young, bright minds come here and, and, and put a stake in the front. As an entrepreneur, if you fear to just share your ideas, you're probably not ready. Uh, ID is 1%, execution is 99. And I can tell you that this is. 99.9. .9. Oh, yeah. So if you're not yeah. ready to share that 0.1%, you're just, you're just not ready to be there. The first time you're going to talk to a client, everybody's going to know about it. Okay. So if you're not ready now, what makes you confident you're going to take your first client? 